Hey, what is going on? This is Rob from Panther. Today we're going to check it out how to do some wrinkles in Illustrator. First step, make sure that you're on the stroke. I'm going to select the circle, the ellipse tool. I'm going to press and hold Shift plus Alt to create a perfect circle. And now I'm going to press Control C and then Control F, or you can go to the edit, paste in front. I'm going to press Shift plus Alt, scale it down until it becomes really small and tiny. I'm going to zoom in to see what is going on here. This is it, until it's going to become a little dot. From here, I'm going to select the external circle. I'm going to go to the effects, distort and transform, roughen. I'm going to click on smooth, decrease the details. I'm going to go with six. I'm going to go with the size seven, click OK. I'm going to go to object, expand appearance. Select both the little circle and the big one. And from here, I'm going to go to the object, blend and make. I'm going to double click on the blend tool, select specify steps and increase the numbers a lot until it's going to look like more wrinkly. I'm going to also decrease the, what is the thickness to 0.25. This might look even better. I'm going to double click on the blend, increase the number. You know, you can experiment, but this one is like pretty dope. And this was it. Thanks for watching. And if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates and also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye bye.